which one's, I mean, one spooky night. The engines were telling spooky stories at the wrong time. <laughs> Sixteen was just finishing off his story, and then they all, they all, they all went oof, boom, bang, crunch, banana. So scary. Oh, come on, it wasn't that scary. Why? Well, I, I mean, it's better than your story. I mean, it's better than your story about a baboon dying or something. I don't know. I have to keep it safer. Ben is a little sensitive. No. Don't worry, I'm perfectly fine. Don't worry, don't worry, I'm actually perfectly fine, I can promise you. I'm perfectly fine. Mm -hmm. He's not fine. Your story now. Um, whoever wants to go next. It's my turn. Have I ever told you about Smudger? Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. Yeah, you, you better be. Have I ever told you about the ghost of Edgy Bridge? Oh, this is going to be a real treat. Uh, uh, oh, look after me, Percy. Ah, look after me. Please, please look after me. Well, legend has it. A long time ago, a little engine was returning home. It was a misty moonlit. Oh, don't hit me up with that. Duncan gets spooked. It's different. Oh, okay. Well, a long time ago, a little engine was returning home. Oh, and it was a misty night when then suddenly, crunch, boom, bang, crunch, banana. Oh, no, oh, no. He fell off. He fell off. He derailed and was dangling dangerously from the edge of the bridge where the yard was. Oh my god, I'm gonna fall, I'm gonna die. Mm. Then, his, then, Cody arrived at night. But then, oh no, crunch. Oh god, please, don't hurt me, please, please. Oh no. Oh God, I'll get the crane. When his friend lifted him up, he had turned into a mangled piece of metal that was definitely the same shape as his actual body. I mean, it mangled himself would make sense, but it wasn't the same. Then he took it away, but he heard Hit his friend's whistle. <coughs> oh God, I'm out of here, he said. And then he pulled the train away. When he hurried in, the controller told him to leave to get the crane he was, that the dead remains of his friend were on. And take them away to their smelting plant and just dump them there. So he disconnected from the other crane and and set off and set off. <laughs> then, then he was taken away to be smelted down and killed. <laughs> Crunch. Are you okay, Ben? <laughs> Perfectly fine, Percy, don't worry. Just then, the invisible controller arrived. Ah, oh, Ben, just the engine. I need you to take the, the, um, the this to the, uh, um, to over the bridge and back again because we're basically bored. Let all that, well, Leverton has it. That he that he crawls along at night. He crawls at night, trying to 
find the end, but he always goes crunch and d boom bang crunch and all sausage and die. Uh, 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 said Ben as he slowly set off. Soon Ben arrived at the yard. So then he arrived in the yard and buffered up to his trucks. So then Din Dun did, and then he realised. Was his brake van? Hello, Mr. Ben. Oh, hi, to Toad. You've just lightened my spirits. Was that sarcasm? No, but I'm glad it is. Yay! 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 Ben was chuffing steadily up the edgy hill along the line very, very, very slowly because slow and steady wins the race. You're right there, Mr. Narrator. I don't even move at all. Yay! However, they were getting nearer and nearer to the top of the hill where his go where the ghost of the engine would appear. Oh no. At last, nearly at the top, Toad, we just have a Shh. What was that, Mr. To Mr. Ben? I don't know, Toad. We'll have to keep going, though. Then, as they kept going... Boop, boop. Oh, no! He said, and he roared backwards. Boop, boop. Crunch! Bam, boom, bang! I hope nothing too serious happened to that. <gasps> oh, no! Below, there were some crashed remains of a, the engine didn't look really like an engine, but a heap of twisted scrap. Oh no, I'll get the crane. But then as he looked back, but as he looked back, it disappeared. Oh god, let's go. And he quickly chuffed away. Merry Christmas, but it's nearly Halloween, faggots. <laughs> Soon Ben arrived at the yard. Oh my gosh, I'm going to get out of here. <laughs> Soon, Ben arrived at the yards. But when he arrived, everyone was asleep. So he went to sleep too.